Hello everyone, in this video I will show you the Kinkoni Smart Home System and work with this different mobile phone application at the same time and also can use this traditional switch, this older switch you can see the, this is 8S board that have downloaded the KCS firmware and this is Kinkoni Server Mini that is Raspberry Pi controller and install the Home Assistant the first you can see I can use the wall switch uh, this is the old wall switch traditional version that I have connect uh, this switch button to the digital input so that I can use this to turn on and turn off so this logical can set in our KCS firmware website later I will show you which website sets this FTTT command so you can see here that is for menu country button if the switch is broken if the software is broken also you can use it here uh, this menu country button at here so this is for traditional switch and this is for RF remote you can see I can turn on the really one uh, by this RF remote and now I will show you how to use this mobile phone application from the Kingoni system and this mobile phone is the Huawei Mate X5 the newest uh, mobile phone you can see uh, the screen uh, will be large and this will be small and I can also use the Tuya application you can see I can use the Tuya Smart Life or Tuya Smart I can use this one and for turn on uh, this relay just by Tuya application for all on and for all off and also I can use a home assistant uh, this is Tuya so I can use this home assistant uh, you can see I can change to A8S board so you can see that is for all on and this is for all off but if you want to use the web browser uh, you can see I can use this this one is by IP address I just connect it directly by the IP address so you can see it here that is turn on relay one two three for every channel relay so you can see I can turn on all and all off so this is by the mobile phone web browser directly and if you want to use two applications at the same time the state also will update you can see I can let it uh, turn to this position and become large and also I can use the two window this is home assistant I just use this function that is for Huawei Mate 5 X uh, so you can see this two mobile phone application I can turn on relay 1 you can see this is home assistant turn on relay 1 this relay 1 by web page update you can see I can turn on relay 2 use home assistant it updates and turn on relay 3 and this will be updated so if I can turn all off and this turn all on you can see as uh, this different software will update the seat so this is used by the different application controlling this one really controller at the same time so you can close it close it so that also you can use the Tuya you can see just like this this Tuya and for our uh, so this can use the different uh, mobile phone application uh, just use this way uh, you can let your let your panel become smart and will be easy to turn on and turn off okay this is the mobile phone application work at the same time and this is our web page on the pc and i have used the kcs firmware so you can see that i have set the ftd command so that you can use the IF remote and the traditional switch so you can see I can create uh, this for a traditional switch you can see I can click this edit and you will see uh, this digital input one that is triangle by this both edge you can see uh, this is for the tr traditional switch and this also can use the single click double click and hold on for this momentary switch uh, this can be this momentary switch that can support uh, one click and double click and hold down so you can use a different switch just set the FTD command 
And also we can see it's the home assistant and this is the KCS firmware web page and this is without Raspberry Pi and this is used by Raspberry Pi. You can see this is a Tuya mobile phone application and this is the web page and this is home assistant. I can turn all on in home assistant, the Tuya is update, the web page update. I turn off at here and that home assistant update, Tuya is update. And I can turn all on at the Tuya. You can see all is updates. And also we can see I can turn off the switch. That will be changed, changed, and turn on, turn on, turn on, turn on. That will be changed. And also I can use this remote. You can see I can press this button relay one, update, and update, relay one on and relay one off. So this will update at the Tuya and the home assistant and the web page. So this is the whole system, King Kong system, can very flexible, used by the different mobile phone application and the wall switch. I just use the two different wall switch that can be connected to your container. Okay, this is a different country way for the King Kong smart home system. Thanks for watching.